Welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an exciting comparison, is the Arjun tank better than the Tu-90? India operates both these powerful main battle tanks, but which one truly dominates the battlefield? Let's break it down. Introduction to Arjun and T-90. The Arjun MBT is India's indigenously developed tank, designed by DRDO. It boasts advanced firepower, superior armor protection, and a powerful 120mm rifle gun. On the other hand, the T-90 Bhishma is a Russian-origin tank, customized for Indian conditions. It is currently the backbone of the Indian Army's armored forces, firepower and weaponry. The Arjun tank comes equipped with a 120mm rifled gun, capable of firing various ammunition types, including high-explosive rounds and anti-tank shells. It also has an advanced fire control system, giving it excellent accuracy. The T-90, however, is armed with a 125mm smoothbore gun, capable of launching anti-tank guided missiles, ATGMs, giving it a slight edge in long-range combat. Armor Protection The Arjun is fitted with conchon composite armor, which provides excellent protection against enemy shells and missiles. It has superior resistance against penetration compared to many contemporary tanks. The T-90, while equipped with Contact 5 ERA, explosive reactive armor, is relatively lighter and more mobile but slightly less protected than the Arjun in direct combat. Mobility and Speed The T-90 is designed for agility. Weighing around 46 tons, it is significantly lighter than the Arjun, which weighs nearly 68 tons. This weight difference makes the T-90 more maneuverable, especially in mountainous and riverine terrains. The Arjun, while powerful, struggles in certain regions due to its heavier build. Technology and Systems The Arjun MBT is a technologically superior tank with an advanced computerized fire control system, thermal imaging, and superior crew comfort. The T-90, while effective, has older technology, though it has been upgraded over time. The Arjun also boasts hydropneumatic suspension, allowing better shock absorption in rough terrains. Operational Effectiveness while the Arjun excels in firepower and armor, its heavy weight limits its deployment. The T-90, being lighter, is more versatile and can be quickly mobilized across different battlefields. The Indian Army favors the T-90 due to its logistical ease and the ability to operate in diverse conditions. Final verdict, which one is better? If we consider pure firepower and protection, the Arjun is undoubtedly superior. However, in real battlefield conditions, mobility and operational ease matter, giving the T-90 an advantage. This is why India continues to use both, depending on mission requirements. What do you think? Should India develop a next-generation Arjun tank? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exciting defense content.